Hi everyone, it's PW here, back with the May edition of the Beat the GMAT Scoop. As usual, let's start on the main page of the BTG website, where there are a lot of amazing articles. For example, this one, don't judge a sentence by the way it sounds. In my verbal GMAT practice, I tend to rely a lot on my ear as a way to select the answer choice that sounds right to me. The experts at Veritas Prep tell us that this is not the best approach, and they've put together some tips on how to better tackle sentence correction. It's definitely worth a read through. Next, here's an overview of the upcoming events in the month of May. Be sure to bookmark this page to keep up to date and know what's going on. Again, our GMAT Avengers study group takes place every week on the Facebook page. Sign up for sessions now by clicking the join button and make sure you've liked the page. On May 10th, the GMAT Avengers will be discussing, discussing weekend CR questions, and on May 17th, they'll be talking about circles. I want to take this opportunity to remind you that the deadline for the annual Beat the GMAT Scholarship is coming up on May 19th. Get your applications in to be considered for these incredible prize packages. These packages and the, and the prizes that you get are going to really help you with your GMAT preparation and you can get access to experts that will help you make your application the best that it can be. Next, we're going to look at some current MBA news articles. It's quite interesting, especially this one, an interview with INSEAD Dean Ilian Milov. It's really great because you can get an insider's view on the future direction and get a more intimate understanding of the new dean's perspective. You can read more on the Poets and Quants website. Another article that might be really interesting for prospective applicants is looking at what the current salary trends of MBA grads are. There are some hefty base salaries that are being given out to grads of the Kellogg School of Management, starting at 370 k It's actually a really good sign for us as prospective students, and it's a big incentive for us to work really hard on GMAT prep and all of our school applications. For the female pool of candidates, there's this article, Power Up Female Executives, How to Be the Leader You Were Meant to Be. And it's a really eye-opening read about leadership, supporting each other, and finding allies. We all need to be aware of the challenges faced and learn to power up to achieve lasting success in the workplace. I think I'd like to hear what your thoughts are about this article are. Leave comments below. On MBA Watch, I'd like to welcome three new schools. First is La Roche International School of Hotel Management and Gillian Institute of Higher Education. They're both from Switzerland. And finally, Lincoln University from Oakland, United States. Check these schools out and more and let me know how you make use of the MBA Watch service so we can make it work better for you. Finally, I want to remind you that there are some great online resources directly on the Beat the GMAT YouTube channel. You can click through for webinar recordings and also updates on what's going on throughout the website. So until next month, study hard and prepare with intention. Keep in touch with us via the forums or leave a comment below.